Hello again from Lower Bear River, December 23rd, 2022, looking for salmon. I'm noticing that the flow and the Lower Bear River is really low. Maybe that's why there's no salmon. It's probably, you know, if I look at this thing right here, maybe five cubic feet per second. I mean, it's low. You know, I was looking at a big pool, but that's the flow. I don't know how well you can see that, but it's really low. And then here I noticed too, very low, narrow channel, shallow, um, really low flow. So either they're further down, maybe just right waiting at the confluence to see what can happen. But yeah, I think that's why there's no salmon, is the flow is really low. So old Camp Far West is hanging on to the water. You know, they're all the same, all these water extractors. They care about the water and the electricity and, and they don't care about the salmon, the fish. And then look at how channelized this is. Look at the bank over there, levee behind me really steep bank, totally channelized in here. And because it's so low, it's created a little bit of riparian within the steep banks of this uh, little river that's coming through this area, this agricultural area. I guess when it floods, it floods. All the roads in here say subject to flooding, so I guess when it rains, it pours, but right now, Little Bear River is flowing. It looks like to be about five cubic feet per second, is it? Very low flow. So we'll wait for the next batch of serious rain, see if that has changed anything. I mean, they got the gravels, got wide open spaces, but the water, the flow is not there. Okay, that's it. And we were up at the Lincoln Gauging Station. We didn't see any salmon coming through there. The flow was better, actually. Okay, that's it. Look at these trees and the sky. It's so pretty. Bear River walks in beauty. She carries beauty. Wherever she goes, she makes the places that she walks beautiful. Omatakweas and Maniwachoni. We love you, Bear River. Water is life.